Today you guys are in for a treat. We have slow cooker caramel peanut butter hot fudge cake. That is a mouthful. All right, we want to start off with one cup of flour. Then we add one half a cup of sugar, one teaspoon of baking powder, one cup of milk. There you go. One third cup of vegetable oil, one half a teaspoon of vanilla extract. We're going to mix that together thoroughly. Like always, guys, I do have the recipe below in the description. We're going to add three quarters of a cup of peanut butter. Get that mixed up like so. And then we're going to grease the bottom and the sides of a crock pot. Mine's a seven quart, so it will be thinner than if you used a thicker one, I mean, uh, a smaller one. Uh, now you come back with 15 to 20 Rolos until it pretty much looks like this. All right, then we're going to come back with three tablespoons of unsweetened cocoa powder, one half a cup of sugar, and one cup of boiling water. And we're going to mix that thoroughly and cover the top of the cake like this. Uh, now it's time to cover. If you have um, a manageable crock pot, you want to do it for six hours. Let it cook. I just checked on it. Let's cover it back. Now it is done. Now it's time to eat this delicious looking dish here. Uh, oh man. Yep. Oh, the Rolos and the chocolate from the Rolos and caramel just come oozing out. Um, I like the cake because it's really moist. It is really peanut buttery, really rich in peanut butter. It goes really good with. Uh, vanilla ice cream. I like Bluebell's homemade vanilla, but you can use whatever ice cream you want. This is it. And you know, I really like crock pot recipes because they do make it really easy for you. You know the routine, guys. If this helped you out, please subscribe to my channel. I love making these videos, so thanks. Have a great day.